And Annette Hessler? Hessler. Hessler. Mm -hmm. Hessler. Okay. I'll share a couple of verses with you before we start. The book of Ephesians it says, Giving thanks always for all things unto God and the Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, submitting yourselves one to another in the fear of God. Let's pray. Father, I pray for Harry and Annette. The Lord, should be with them in a special way right now. Pray, Father, that you might meet their needs, whatever they may be, whether it be physical, financial, mental, spiritual, whatever the needs are. Lord, should intervene for them. But most especially right now, pray that you give them wisdom. Wisdom about all the joy and contentment, fulfillment this relationship offers. Pray, Father, that you exchange their vows. That these vows would come from their heart, realizing what you join together that no man can put asunder. We thank for your presence. We do ask for your guidance. And can you bless upon this couple in Jesus' name. If you, Harry, and you, Annette, have freely and deliberately chosen each other as partners for life, would you join your right hands, please? Harry, we have this woman to be a wedded wife. Will you love her, honor, and keep her in sickness as in health, in poverty as in wealth, and keep thee only unto her as long as you both shall live, do you so promise? I will. I do. Annette, we have this man to be a wedded husband. Will you love him, honor, and keep him in sickness as in health, in poverty as in wealth, and keep thee only unto him, as long as you both shall live, do you so promise? I do. I'm going to ask you to repeat some vows. And these vows you're exchanging with each other. Okay? Harry, if you would repeat after me, please. Yeah. I, Harry. I, Harry. Take thee, Annette. Take thee, Annette. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poor. For richer, for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and cherish. To love and cherish. To death do us part. Till death do us part. Okay, and then you would repeat after me, please. I am Ed. I am Ed. Take thee, Harry. Take thee, Harry. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. And to have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poor. For richer, for in sickness and in health, in and in health. To, love and cherish. to love and cherish, to death to us part. It's one of the traditional things handed down through the years, but there's none just exactly like the rings. The rings were given more for the memory than for the jewelry. The beauty of the ring represents the beauty of your relationship together. But the construction of the ring should remind you of what's taking place today. If we were to take the whole ceremony, just bring it down to one word, if that word would be commitment. The person you were holding hands with, you commit most of your life to that person. And the ring's there to remind you that commitment is never ending. That's this kind of commitment you have for each other. This hair, which you signify the place of this ring, on the third finger of the net's left hand. It went on there yesterday. It went on there earlier, too. <laughs> Never that. Take this and place it on the third finger of Harry's left hand. And Harry, she gives you the ring. She gives it to you because she loves you. And you'll wear it because you love her. Yes, I will. For as much then as you, Harry, and you, Annette, have freely and deliberately chosen each other as partners for life, as minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, the Lord given by the state of Georgia, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You can kiss the bride. For God has joined together, let no man but a son. This is Mrs. Harry and Annette Hitchpath. Congratulations. Thank you. Got your license. I'll take the judge his copy of the license. They'll record it there. This is your copy. The purpose for this, if you lose the paperwork, you have proof. Okay. So keep this in a safe place. Sure. You do have to send off for the certified copy of your marriage license. Mm -hmm. That's the legal document. You'll need that for name changes. Just follow instructions, fill in the blanks. They ask for your names just like they appear on the license, today's date, and your return address. But okay. this with the money order, back to probate court for five dollars. Just send this with the money order about a week's time to send you the certified copy back. Okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you.